Welcome back to YouTube. Dodge Dragon is back with another video. It's been a while. Uh, we've been really busy uh, with breeding beer dragons, uh, trying to breed super worms, and also dubia roaches. Um, this is our new enclosure. I would like to give a big shout out to uh, Philip at EB3 Customs. He did a great job. Um, anything that you would like to get done, uh, I'd recommend go through EB3 Customs. Not only does he do reptile enclosures, but also small animal enclosures, enclosures as well. Like I said, it's all custom made, handmade. He does a great job. This is a very large enclosure. They actually had him build for me. I actually had him build it to support my TV, to put my TV on top of there. And if you look, I mean, it's, it's huge. And he did a great job. Um, he also put through like this piece of trim on here. I mean, it's very nice, very large. It made the house, there's two separate enclosures. It actually has a divider in it. Um, it's got two glass doors on the one side. That right there is a fireball. He's our German giant, beer dragon. This one here, I actually got two females in there. And this here has also got the uh, two doors as well. Um, they're on magnetic. There's magnets that pop the doors in and out, like you would see on like a stereo cabinet. However, um, these beer dragons, they do like the glass serve a lot. So I actually drilled out two holes and put these little pegs down in there so that way it's like a locking mechanism um, I couldn't really find a suitable lock mechanism for uh, the popping out glass unlike the sliding glass doors you know I could find those really easy but for something like this I just really quickly just just for the meanwhile just... so in order to open this I'll just slide slide these out I just pull these two out. And then my doors just open. Same with on this side. Like that. Like I said, I mean, they stay closed, but you know, he's such a big beard dragon, I'm afraid he'll just pop that right open. So, I just take these little pegs, they're kind of like dowel rods, and I just put them right here in the holes, and then that way, I don't have to worry about when I'm, when I'm not home, about these guys getting out. Same with on this side, I did the same thing on this side. Just remove these two little pegs. You know, you just remove one side if you want. It is very nice. I got some uh, driftwood in there. Turned out to be a really nice, qu high quality, custom beer dragon closure. Like I mentioned before, you definitely want to go to EB3 Customs. I mean, you can't. He made it exactly the fit in this corner, in this right here in the square of my wall here. I mean, it's like flush with the wall on this side. I mean, it's flush with the wall on that side. And it goes all the way to that side of the wall. I mean, it's custom made, EB3 Customs. Definitely uh, look him up on Facebook and also on, he's also got a webpage, EB3 Customs. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Until next time, later.